Okay, y'all, this is like a weird placement, like, but I think this, I think this should be good. I don't, I don't know. I'm trying to fix it, but it's like weird. So this is, okay, I, I feel like people that don't follow me on TikTok, they, you need this update if this is drawn to you, you know, type of thing. So I started on TikTok, but follow my TikTok if you got it, because I just be on there more. So look, I'm about to start off with the story from yesterday so i got a download yesterday right um i was scrolling my fyp on tiktok and then the video came up and, and and it was like they had said something of the nature in the words oh i'm going to kill myself if you leave me and i thought to myself what the fuck that's so weird and then i immediately got a download and heard the karmics are literally saying i'm going to kill myself if you leave me you know trying to do that manipulative shit and i realized i emphasized on the fact that I literally went through this with my karmic. So you literally mirror, I mean, it's baby, it's kind of like it's to a T at this point. True twin flames mirror each other's lives. I went through the exact, exact, exact shit with my karmic. I'm gonna kill myself if you leave me. What about miracle? What about this? What about, what, who's gonna, who's gonna, I'm going to kill myself. I need you, man. Look, all of that, all of that. At the time, you know, you feed into the little stupid-ass narcissistic bullshit. But then afterwards, when you realize, this bitch, kill yourself then. Go ahead. Go ahead. And still don't. Still stalking me to this day. And still didn't. It's just manipulation to keep you. So the masculines, feminines are currently going through this, this crazy-ass mess. Girl, this crazy-ass mess. So what I pull, okay, what I pull for... This was the first card that came out was was strength so when i explained on tiktok i said there's someone helping the masculine but spirit don't want me to talk about that there's either someone who has passed over or someone who is on this 3d physical plane physically helping and then there's something there's a light there's others guiding him out of this light there's bubbles around him you know when you do a cleanses a cleanses have bubbles in it that's your that's them taking your shit you see how it's surrounding this person this is so crazy this is why i love cards i don't need card but this, this i love the visual of it because what i try to see in my mind and what i explain in my mind i be trying to explain verbally and sometimes it don't come out this is why i love decks like baby i am so Look, ten of swords, cut the deck, ten of swords. This person been trying to find a way out this fucking shit for a very long time. Look, look. To find a way out this shit. It's just, it's been overgrown. It's been ratchet, nasty rats. Just overgrown. Somebody feels like they've been suffocating in this shit. It's toxic. Baby, I just said suffocation. This toxic ass family has been suffocating the hell out this person. So look, this card is really speaking to me because... It's, it's speaking to me because, look, you got the spirit guides and the ancestors guiding this person out, pulling them out. And then you have this octopus that thinks they're not going anywhere. And look at the naysayers. Look at the people watching this shit. There go the raggedy mama. There go the raggedy daddy. There go the little raggedy cousins and the friends all in the background. He, he can't leave you just like that after so many long nights. She can't do that. She can't just up and leave. Y'all got bills. What about the kids? <coughs> what about the kids? What about this? What about that? Three 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 on the clock. This is some crazy ass shit because she thinks he don't have the inner strength to leave, and really he's getting the fuck up out of there. If you don't, if they don't live with each other, he's literally he cut this person off. I'm trying to tell you. She's going to pop up at his house, his mama house. I heard. Suppose, oh, child, I see somebody popping up at your, your son, your son. You, what? I don't know what's wrong with your son. The mama don't even fuck with you like that. Even though he has his issues with his his mama, she ain't choosing you. She ain't fuck with you. <coughs> like, girl, and if she is, there's a mother that's saying, oh, he needs to get it together. Um, You guys been together for so long. You're a karmic, bitch. You're a karmic. You're a karmic. Anyway, this is what I see with this card, though. This person... He's leaving it all behind. Look at the glamour, the glitz, the gold, the, the big house. <laughs> per se the cars the money the stability stability this ain't fucking stable this shit is dark as shit the bit this is literally speaking to me this bitch is an octopus what does octopus tentacles do they suck they latch on to things this bitch is a leech she's been a leech forever 
She's been a narcissistic leech forever. He's breaking away from this shit. Not trying to. He's breaking away. He don't give a fuck if he lose hair in this process. He don't give a fuck if he loses chains. He don't give a fuck. He don't get. He will leave it all behind. There's a karmic that has bought this masculine chains and jewelry and oh, what you gonna do with your jewelry? Bitch, you want it? Do you want it? Here. Here you go. She don't like that. Mm-mm. She don't like that he's giving up everything to leave. You want this? You want that? You want the car? Okay, bitch, you got it. You got it, bro. You got Bye. You got it. Look, this is retrograde. The universe is pushing this masculine to leave, this feminine to leave. This is retrograde. Retrograde is whooping everybody's ass, not just, you know. But retrograde is, is shedding light on a couple of things that need to be shed. Four, five, four, five. Okay? The universe is, like, pushing this person. You know what I'm saying? To, like, it's time to go before this fucking shit blow up it's time to go like we're trying to get you out of here because you're doing the lessons you're doing the healing you're you're finding yourself you're bringing truth to yourself you're in homer mode we're trying to get you to go before this shit really fuck like blow up because what's gonna happen is somebody going to jail i'm not saying the masculine but some, some shit's gonna pop off you know what some shit's gonna pop off this, this particular masculine has cleared their debt has cleared their karmic lessons has cleared off a lot of karma off of their soul contract so there's no way in hell the spirit will allow you to go to jail or catch an std or anything like that because you're not dealing with nobody you learned your lessons your sacred chakra is being healed your sexual addictions are being healed your whole mindset has changed being in hermit mode you are actually ready to come forward to your feminine and be with your feminine but the spirit is saying go you remember when I said this a long time ago, y'all? This is the current frequency of these wave three wave three twins. It is now a go time for these wave three twins. This is a twin twin for me. This is the matrix twin and this is the spiritual twin. You're elevated, they're elevated. You see, I literally just seen this person's face clearing up and being more happier and being more stable. This is unstable, right? It's a lot. It's a lot of energy going on. Um, but... This spirit is saying, you've been suffocating for too long, baby. You finally realize that this bitch, look, heavy, heavy, heavy dark magic. We don't say black magic here. We know what black magic is. If you don't know what black magic is, it's me. Um, dark magic. We need to start saying dark magic. Anything black that's negative, that's negative comes from, from a racist come on come on y'all wake up wake up wake up wake up now it's time to wake up about that it's not black magic it's dark magic everything is dark and light dark magic why does black have to be you get what i'm saying i can't stand when somebody say that shit i can't because I, I i know i know the difference and i know that's some foul ass shit so dark magic has been working its way okay when when you're dealing with twins and you all call, now somebody can spell your ass and fuck you up because your ass probably got some karma going on in the world that you ain't clear probably you just a dark ass soul and you deserve it but when you heal and you take accountability for who you are and what you chose to do when you take accountability for who you chose you are completely fucking protected this person is dark as hell. This bitch, she's not a church goer. It's somebody in the house that y'all need to pray. Y'all need to look to God. And you the darkest bitch of all. You the darkest bitch of all. Even with your uh whoever the hell this is to so your cousin, your little sister, your little your little granddaughter, you and her been doing rituals. Basically, in everybody in the house. There's even another masculine around that feels slumped. That feels low. That feels like he's just dead inside. Because the men that be in that house, they all got rituals on their ass. And now that that karma is clear for the divine masculine, they can't touch him. They can't touch this person. That's this. That's the soul contract, baby. This person is divine as fuck. He's heavily fucking protected. You cannot touch this person. This person has the inner strength to leave your ass. 922 on the clock. So then we went on to look at this person. This person, man, somebody come get me. Please, please come get me. This bitch is crazy. This bitch got me. She following me all throughout the night. I'm just want to sit in the car and chill, smoke a little bit, be by myself. I got to protect myself. I got to lock my doors. I got this. She's trying to hit. I told you on TikTok. Somebody is trying to handcuff somebody to the motherfucking bed. <laughs> like, girl, girl, girl. What is going on? What is going on here? Um, <clears throat> This is so much despair, so much sorrow. But see, 
See, now the masculine has awoken, and that's because you have awoken. Twins are a mirror. He couldn't have awoken without you. You you was triggering him. So when I said you had to wake up to your spirituality, spirituality so he can, that's what the fuck I said. And that was that's the truth about it. That's the truth about it. You were stuck in your head, so he was stuck in his shit. That's why he was in her room mode away from your ass. You were stuck in your head, so he was stuck in his shit. I told you, twins are a mirror. It's not a you thing. It's not a you, 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 you did this. What the fuck did you do? What did you do to create these trees that he is now it has to chop down? What did y'all do together? What did y'all do together? Look, the devil at the bottom of the deck, codependency here. This bitch is so codependent, y'all. Look, look, look. The truth about it is, this person has been, I got many energies here. Listen, here go you. This for somebody specific. You did this, you did that. You, he doing this, he doing that though, spirit. Wrong. What are you doing? Pay attention to you. Be honest with yourself. You stabbed yourself in the back. You dealt with this. You chose to deal with this person. You chose to deal with his unhealed ass. You chose to deal with that karmic. Nobody put a fucking stake to your head and said, do this shit. You chose it. So you blame you. Anyway, moving on. That's 11 on 11, let <laughs> baby. Come on now. Watch out for the times now. Now, this person, the truth about it is he is fighting for his motherfucking life because he is committed to coming out of this bullshit. Somebody is like kind of worried scared afraid anxious because he's coming out of this dark era that has been consuming him in lies for so very long okay for so very long all right like it's just it's like that i just exhale like man man like man i'm tired look this person been self-sabotaging. This person been breaking up and making up and, and, and the silent treatment and stopping the path. The reason why he used silent treatment on you is because she used silent treatment on him. A narcissist mirrors. <laughs> a narcissist actually mirrors what you do to other people. <laughs> like... Like, or you go off of what you've been taught and conditioned by the narcissist. That's why this masculine used to think money, 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 money. I got to get money. I got to get money. But the household need money. It's not all about money no more. It's all about freedom and feeling safe enough to express your truth and feeling safe enough to to be you. To be you. Full, full, whole, hard, full, fully, um, heartedly, right? What's that word? Full heartedly, okay? One, two, three, on the four. It's, the, the pattern has been stopped. And she don't like it. What's this card that fell? Being lighthearted and the things coming to light. You're about to find out about some shit that you did not find out about. And it may actually frighten you. This is why I said there's multiple energies here. It may actually frighten you and say, what the fuck? That's what the fuck? Look, this person is saying, what the fuck? That's what the fuck you been through? Oh, my goodness. Like, what the hell? You, it may shock you. The truth is going to shock the shit out of you. Because some things you don't know just because you're intuitive and all that other bullshit don't mean that you know everything. Things will be un unmasked at the time when they were supposed to be unmasked. Yes, I'm a high priestess and yes, I can know everything. Yes, I can just ask. Yes, I know and pull crit tarot. But it's some things that my team have purposely held from me because they probably know she ain't going to like that or she need to hear that from whoever that, need, that needs to come to light on her own time. They know. They know. So just because you're asking Tudor don't mean you know everything, goddammit. Do you say you know everything? You don't know shit. Look. So at the end of the day, this soul contract really makes this masculine happy as fuck. He is so happy. They are so happy. He, she, wherever, take the whatever. We on this channel, I say he. Okay. So he is so happy that he has a soul contract with you. And not with this person that he has been having outdated thinking about. He is so happy that the conditioning. He's also replaying events in his head about everything that has happened between you two. He kind of hates himself. He does. Um, he does not fuck with the energy that he was in while he was fucking with you. He does not like that shit whatsoever. He don't. But let's just keep it real. You had to you had to learn, you had to awaken, you had to realize who the fuck she is and who the fuck you were. Let's just be real here. Without learning, how could you how could you know? I work a lot to stay busy away from her and this bullshit. This masculine be purposely at work, looking for work, looking for double jobs, triple jobs. I do not want to be there, bruh. I do not want to be there at all. I took you for granted. 
it was never just sex. If you thought it was just sex, it was never just sex. I already have a family. I do. I don't want it. This is not my family. This is not my family. I took you for granted. This person feels so shitty inside. I'm trying to describe the feeling. It's like grunt. A bunch of grunt all in my back, all in my stomach, all in my chest. Grunt is moving as rocks turn and, and churn inside of this person as very uncomfortable, sharp pains from the heart and all sacred, all chakras. Third eye open, throat chakra opening. Heart is uh, been open, been open, been healed, just been scared to express it. Sh sacral chakra is healing from the sexual addictions. The root chakra is being rooted and grounded in earth and knowing I am abundant without anyone else. I can be abundant by myself. And even when I get with my feminine or my masculine, I will be abundant together. There's a there's a, a, a feminine that literally is the mass the, the the matrix twin. She ran so bad from your love, but that's because she needed to. You needed her to so you can awake the fuck up. You needed them to break you and hurt you so you can wake up. It should have never been toxic. Never been toxic. Toxic is 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 karmics now, okay? It should have never been toxic. Somebody's getting engaged. Somebody it should have never been toxic, okay? But karmics are what that is, toxic. So I took you for granted. I regret the fuck out of that. But that's okay. I keep saying that's okay because it's the truth. It is okay for you to take somebody granted because you need it to realize what you needed to heal. I typed a paragraph, but I deleted it. So somebody is, is, is typing paragraphs. Look, look, here we go again. I have a family. I don't want it. Message me now. I promise I will, I will reply. You don't message them. You don't reach out. If you the feminine, you sit and you receive. You sit and you receive. That's it. That's all. The person who's been ghosting the person the most, you reach out. You reach out. It is your turn to reach out. They just, they just deathly afraid, but they have to come forward because, bro, you finna lose out on the best thing ever. Cause look, we not finna just sit here and, and just wait and wait and wait and wait and wait and wait. We can have patience. We can wait, but baby, at some time in the day, people want to be loved. People want to be loved. I think this shit is reverse as hell. In the in between, yes. Okay, this is reverse. I look. I this, he don't even like this girl. I love you as a. I love her as a person. I'm not in love at all. He don't even like this person. He don't. He don't even like this person. This pull towards you is in unbearable as hell. You are magical. I wear masks with you because my feelings are too deep. It is time to unmask those feelings. It is time to come out of this fantasy world of he's going to be rejected. It is time to come out of this. If you if you reject your masculine or feminine, you're not ready and you're about to go right back into separation because how the hell after all the time you say, I want my masculine, I want my masculine, I want my feminine, and you reject them because they're not telling you what you want to hear. You you want to hear the truth? Listen to the motherfucking truth. It's going to shock the fuck out of you. I just said that. Listen to the truth. You cannot bend and twist the truth to how you want to see, hear it and see it. If that man say, I honestly thought you was a fucked up ass person. That's something that you have to deal with. That's something that you have to listen and realize 18, 18 on the clock. That's just how he felt and what the fuck he was going through. You have to listen to the truth no matter what it is. I honestly thought you was the karmic. You can't say, well, how did you, how did you think that? What do you mean? Because he was in a low karmic energy. He thought everybody was out to get his ass. By you coming in, this is the last thing I'm going to say because over 20 minutes, it's going to take forever to fucking uh, upload. By him doing all that and realizing you are the feminine, you are the divine masculine, they had to realize. And by you saying, oh, how could you just think I was the karmic? Because he was in karmic energy, girl. He think everybody out to get him. When you come in and try to love somebody 1855 on the clock and you love them from the heart and depths of your, of your soul, with no, you don't want nothing in return. No money. You're not manipulating them with sex. You're not. They think you out to get them. And that's it. That's all. That's what it was. He had to awaken to the truth that you actually really love him and fuck with him. Cut the deck. He had to find the truth. Baby, he had to find the truth and start giving to himself. So he, 1919 on the clock. So he can come and give to you. After he found himself. Where's Waldo? Finding himself. 
How could you think that? Because he had to think it, to feel it, to grow from it, to heal it, to get through it. So if you, but baby, somebody about to go right back into separation. And mark my words, you're going to come back to this video and say, we went back right back into separation because I started to do this and I, I wasn't listening and I wasn't ego. Boom, bada bing. Uh, I'm sorry to say. So you will be back in separation because I'm telling you, you're not fucking ready. You're not ready to actually listen to the truth. So watch when I say separation is going to be.